All right, how are we doing, Central Georgia? The Making Touchdown Club never disappoints. Last night was extra special, though, because, yes, we got to honor our award winners from the 2022 high school football season, but also hear from the greatest coach in the country. UGA head coach Kirby Smart was on hand to chat with the folks last night in Macon. So great to hear from Kirby and, and an update from camp in Athens. Let's move on to the awards, though. The Super 7, seven of the best players in the state of Georgia, four of them from right here in the 478. Zion Reagans, a four-star wide receiver from Jones County, ranked 11th in the state's 2024 class and 56th nationally. He's already got an offer from Kirby and many, many more Division I programs. At Baldwin High School, running back Micah Welch is also a four-star for his career, 448 carries for 2,864 yards and 39 touchdowns. All-purpose yards, he's got more than 3,000 of them with 264 points scored and 44 touchdowns. He also holds offers from Georgia, Georgia Tech, Florida, Tennessee, and so many more Power 5 programs. FPD quarterback Jakari Williams, yet another four-star who's passed for 2,384 yards, completing 164 passes, averaging 216 yards per game. He's got a total of 21 touchdowns. He's also rushed for north of 1,000 yards and 13 more scores on, on the, the ground. Williams verbally committed to Georgia Tech. He's already got or excuse me, he has a year to go still. And then you got Ricardo Jones, four-star safety and wide out from Northside High School. 30 and a half tackles, seven pass breakups, and five, count them, five interceptions. First team all region, first team all state. Offers from Arkansas, Auburn, Florida State, Georgia Tech, and yes, you guessed it, many more. Those are your local Super 7s. How about our back of the year from Northeast High School? You know the name by now. Nick Woodford, as just a sophomore, he led the state in rushing across every classification that was until the final game of the year. 2,746 yards on 273 rushes. Good for 10.1 yards per carry, 40 touchdowns on the year, and the Region 2 AA Player of the Year. Nick's teammate, is your lineman of the year, Johnny Williams, helping Northeast's offense to average 278 yards per game. He graded out at 91% in 2022 with 23 pancake blocks. Johnny was not on hand last night to accept the award because he's already enrolled in class at West Virginia. Congratulations to Sir Williams. Special Teams Player of the Year, he comes from Tattnall Square Academy. That would be Braden Smith. The numbers speak for themselves. 11 kickoff returns in 2022. 412 yards, three returns for touchdowns. The two-time All-Region Special Teams Player of the Year is staying home. He will be joining the Mercer Bears this fall. A packed night at the club. Congratulations to all.